Butte County supervisors are working to learn how a pipeline from Paradise to Chico would impact groundwater. Action News Now reporter Amy Lansky shows us where the pipeline would be and what it would mean for people rebuilding on the ridge. Yeah, Alan, the study is to figure out the possibility of having a pipeline run from right up here in Paradise all the way down the Skyway, down into Chico, right here at Bruce Road is where it would end. Now, there are two reasons that county officials say that this option could be the best one for getting water into Chico. People who live in the area are happy that something's being done. It's you share resources as we're going back and forth trying to rebuild a community. Victoria Sinclair lives in Paradise and she says this is a great way to help. So the project entails um, bringing Paradise Irrigation water, treated water, uh, down the Skyway um, and connecting into the Cal Water um, service area for the Chico area. Paul Goslin from Butte County Department of Water and Resource Conservation says this will provide a customer base for the Paradise Irrigation District. So as the town rebuilds, uh, Paradise Irrigation District um, needs to um, utilize that asset and, and have a funding mechanisms to stay viable while the town rebuilds. Goslin says this will provide them customers through Cal Water. He added the other benefit is to the city of Chico, reducing the demand of groundwater. Cal Water, city of Chico, and that the whole Vina subbasin is 100% dependent upon groundwater. And as we look towards putting some programs and projects in place to sustain the basin, one of the uh, things we're really looking at is how can we better utilize surface water in groundwater dependent areas. When you're looking at the um, lack of consumers, in order for them to continue to be able to meet the responsibility, they have to have money coming from somewhere. As with living up there, you have to be flexible. <laughs> so for for us, for our community, we have to be flexible and share resources to kind of make it to where we can come back from this. The study costs $143,000 and the money is coming from a state grant, Cal Water Service and Paradise Irrigation District. Thank you, Amy. Coming up at 6, we'll look at another water source that is featured, that is future, I should say, is in.